Ladies and gentlemen, give it up for Julia's eye. Because <laughs> we don't know where the fuck it's looking. I got to stand sideways in that motherfucker and just say, Hey, Julia! <laughs> you can see me. <laughs> then I'll give you a motherfucking headache looking at it. <laughs> you know it's Black History Month. I'm about to act a ass. I'm going back to church like like old boy over there. I said I wouldn't cuss anymore, but since Julian brought it out, I'm about to roast you. <laughs> I only drink because I have gout. <laughs> too young, too soon, but all right, hold on. All right, as the twelfth first black person that lives in Visalia, <laughs> we meet every week. It was my turn to bring the Kool-Aid. <laughs> oh, black jokes. My favorite racial slur is coon. <laughs> my favorite racial slur is coon. <laughs> Ever called anybody a coon before? You in the front? Ever thought about it? it? Just rolls off your lips. You coon. <laughs> I'll poke your eyes out, coon. <laughs> He's cooing in almost every sentence. I was late for work. Coon. I'm not gonna pay my rent this month. Coon. Or maybe that's your landlord talking back to you. Nah, I own my own house. I got good credit. Anyway, I'm about to bring a special accessory up because since it is Black History Month, I lined up everybody white at work. I was just, I want y'all to stand two inches apart. I have something very important to tell you. It's Black History Month, bitch! Slap! Slap all of them straight down. You gotta slap white people every once in a while. Where to go? He was over here somewhere. Um, you, you, every once, you know, at least once a week. You know, and they're like, well, it doesn't matter. Y'all got the shortest month anyway. Bullshit, it's a leap year, and we have annexed Martin Luther King Day. We've got the full 30 fucking days. Hispanics, I'm going to need y'all to rise up with me. That's what I'm talking about. Y'all get a month, single de Mayo, and some other holidays y'all done made up and shit. <laughs> Day of the dead, motherfucker. I'm like, where do we eat Where do we eat at? I don't even smoke anymore because I work for the government. Some of y'all ain't paid y'all taxes. <laughs> and I see you. <laughs> Rhapsody, baby, I'm going to need you to bring up Rufus for me. Because it is time for me to get real black. We're going to talk about the highs of black people and the lows of black people. And the left eye of Julian. <laughs> it's like a gray area. It's like a boy. <laughs> Julian, I don't hate you. <laughs> I just hate looking at that eye for more than 20 minutes. That shit confuses me. Thank you, baby. Thank you, baby. That's my pimp point. Thank you, baby. <laughs> my big old ignorant ass. You just want to smell it. That <laughs> probably stinks. <laughs>
Too much. Too soon. Too soon. All right. I'm uh, working some new stuff out. What's fun about being black, y'all, and sometimes people just don't understand how cool it is to be black, is because black people, well, Mexicans, you do understand this. You will stick together for no fucking reason whatsoever. <laughs> no fucking reason. The president. Did you vote for him because he's black? Hell yeah, I didn't even know what he was talking about, and I voted for him. Cause look at his lips, it looks like he smokes cool 100s and shit. <laughs> but Rock is cool, even if y'all don't like him. That motherfucker is cool, you know. Hide the black people. Oprah. Yeah. Oprah. <laughs> this bitch will give shit out for no fucking reason. Think about it. On that show where she gave out them Honda Civics to everybody, you know, my shit had just broke down. I was trying to get on that show, and that bitch was like, look under your seat, there's a fucking Honda Civic, and everybody gets one. The highs of being black. Cool. Don't say that shit with me. I think she's in the car to fuck y'all up. However, the lows of black people. <laughs> y'all know y'all got a couple Mexicans like that that you know too. Damn. My cousin Juan. Mira, mira, mira. Juan is fucking up. Y'all know Mexican. Y'all know y'all say nigga. Y'all say nigga more than us. You know what I'm saying? Especially in the Central Valley. Man, that nigga love me. I bought on to a nigga. How is it? Juan is So anyway, so let me hurry and get to the point. So the lows of black people, how we stick together. I bent over because I've been doing squats. <laughs> and I wanted to show you. <laughs> the lows of black people. O.J. Simpson. But let me break down O.J. Simpson. O.J. Simpson, Lionel Richie, Kobe Bryant, and we'll get to Michael Jackson a little later. <laughs> These are all brothers that left their black wives for white women, and something really tragic happened to all these white women. And here's the fucked up part. Oh, what's, what was the bitch's name? Nicole Simpson? Was that her name? Yeah. That, that got, family knew that OJ was beating her ass for three fucking years. And you know what her mother said, because you know little white, white girls, their mothers teach them from a very small age, get a man with money and you will suck dick. <laughs> that, that's, it's in the handbook. I, my cousin Juan got it for me. <laughs> Too much? Okay. Um, he looks like a boxer. I'm not gonna fuck with him. <laughs> I'm nervous. He's like, that shit's not funny, coon. <laughs> when I do this, the Afro shakes. So anyway, OJ ruined it for everybody. Cause black people were like, you know what? OJ did not kill that woman. <laughs> Allegedly. OJ, if he was your cousin, he would come to your house and everybody would be like, you know OJ didn't kill that girl, but look, when that motherfucker has more than two beers, we got to go. Because <laughs> he's a little violent, you that white girl. <laughs> Ford, stop making Broncos because of this nigga. I'm Drove the Bronco, no Bronco, drove the Bronco down the street with the glove, dropped everything, and OJ, it was a cry for help because he wanted to get caught. So I will drive my Bronco so everyone can see me. Ford was like, I know the fucking general manager of Ford was sitting up there like, fuck, we got to explore some new options. <laughs> And 
make the Bronco one, y'all. Michael Jackson. Michael didn't touch those kids. If Michael Jackson is your cousin and he's coming to your house, me and Juan, let me look, put the kids in the other room because you know Michael's coming over. <laughs> We're making punch and somehow everybody gets drunk off a Kool-Aid. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> he calls it some kind of Jesus juice. I don't know. <laughs> Would you let Michael watch the kids? Hell no, we ain't letting Michael watch the kids. <laughs> but he's innocent. <laughs> cool. But we've given y'all the electric slide. Wait a minute. I'm almost done. I told you one more minute and a half. I'm getting up. This that I that I was fucking with me. Keep it over here. We brought y'all the electric slide. This is what I want y'all to do. This is your homework for tonight. In the morning. <laughs> Electric slide in the mirror for no reason. Even if you don't have any rhythm. You know I'm about to. <laughs> Come on, y'all. Dun 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 clap dun 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 so proud. Dun 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 it's a black. You know, you can scare people in parking lots for no reason. <laughs> You're the first one in your neighborhood. Tiger Woods, this is the last one and then I'm going to go. Tiger Woods, a few years back, I think you guys remember. He wasn't black. I was so strong. He wasn't black. He said, I'm multicultural. They didn't spell multicultural on your house when they spray painted it, did they? It was cool. <laughs> and nigga, but you know what? <laughs> the lows. <laughs> Alright guys, my name is Buck Nasty. Thank you very much. That's it? That's it?